Okay, so in this short video, I just wanna to touch on how you can utilize keywords within your website and your content. I'm not going to go into this in depth. I have another course for that. However, I just wanted to show you where these keywords can be used very quickly. So you can use these keywords once you have your terms that you know you wanna use. You can use them inside of your permalinks right here inside the URL. That's going to help you with SEO. You can also use them, you should use them inside of your description for each post. You can also use them, um, well, you should be using them as a focus keyword as well inside of your blog posts. You can use them to optimize your images and you can also use them outside of, you know, just within your content, of course, within your H1, H2, and H3 headers. And you can be using them in the titles as well. You can also be using them for inside of your categories over here. So these are all my different categories, blogging, content creation tips, and these can be keywords as well. And beyond that, you can also have, I guess I could have showed you here, the categories, and also the tags. So these are all the different places that you can use the keywords to help improve your SEO. And this doesn't just work for WordPress websites, this works for all kinds of websites, but WordPress makes it so easy to optimize everything to its fullest for the, the maximum SEO benefit. So it really, WordPress works really well and that's why they're always going to continue to reign as being one of the, the leading content management systems for probably decades because they work so well at in building things and being able to just make the SEO really quick and easy so that the search engines don't have to work as hard and that your content shows up a lot quicker and faster. So with that being said, that is some ways that you can use these keyword terms to improve your SEO, improve your traffic, and of course get more visitors to your website.